at the bowl here for a training session, of course, ahead of the big game. Uh, with me, though, is Paul from the Craig Harkstrong Foundation. Uh, with this amazing news that you've been able to release this week about uh, helping, well, not just the footballers, but uh, every school out with a, a very essential bit of kit. Over to you. Tell us yeah, about it. Um, basically, we've... Um purchased 35 defibrillators this week um, that we're going to donate to every football club on the island including one here for the Alaman FA plus all the high schools as well um, you know if, if there is an, ever an emergency and someone does collapse which we've seen lately in the press like Fabrice for instance Fabrice here, yeah. and also the Italian that unfortunately yes. um, passed away a couple of weeks ago um, if there is ever such an incident at least you know, every team here has, and every school has the, the relevant kit that could possibly save a life. That's a tremendous commitment. How much money is it talking about here? Yeah, we've spent just over thirty-one thousand pounds on these, um, but it's something that we we've, we've been looking at for a while, and the Moamba incident especially has um, has kicked us um, to do it a bit, really. And then, um, you know, it's it's a piece of kit which cost us nine nine hundred pounds each kit, and if nine hundred pounds can save one life, then you know, we're, we're willing to spend it and we've we've actually got that much money from the Manx public over the last several years that we're in a situation now where we can go ahead and buy this kit. So, so each person, have, well, each place, will they have to have someone trained up to use it, I suppose? Um, you, you can have training, but these things are, are that easy to use that in case of an emergency, anyone with, with the slightest bit of knowledge of first aid, which hopefully you would have at a sporting venue, um, can, can use them straight away. And they actually talk you through everything. Um, if, you're, if you're doing CPR yourself, it will tell you if you're doing it too hard or too soft, and it runs through every, every single step with you. So, um, you know, top, top piece of kit, and um, hopefully, hopefully they never get used. But um, obviously, if they do need to get used, then it's... It's going to be good for the island. And as you said, it'll be here in time for the final. We're, we're hoping um, they'll all arrive this week and we can get one here for, for the cup final and have it have it stored away here. And, and hopefully it doesn't come back out. <laughs>